it's just sort of starting to dawn on me how remote, I suppose, this place is starting to become. Nothing better than waking up in the morning, being the first one to leave. And um, I got a new t-shirt out today. I've had that t-shirt on for three days. And the smell of a new t-shirt. Oh, wow. But go get a coffee and get the fuck out of here. Beat everyone up the road. <laughs> Look at this shower. This is... <laughs> That's all you get. Oh, fucking hell. Just been in there talking to the the people running the, the show inside. Really nice people. Uh, uh, stay here. It's great. Made me coffee. I'm on my way in a minute. Just had me coffee. I don't know what fuel is, how much it is. Don't know. But what I am surprised at is the amount of people that want to tell me that I'm not going to get up there. And it's not these people, they, they, she'll get up there. But the amount of people that say that I'm not going to get up there, like some, uh, I had two people in here tell me that last night, and I had two people snigger at me the other, yesterday, uh, around lunchtime, when I was talking to them saying that I'm coming up to the top, that a snigger, and then... I'm in here before they are, because I overtook them on the road. And they were a bit shocked. But anyway, we're only still on the on the tar. A little bit of dirt, that's all. We'll see how we go today. There must be another vehicle up in front because the dust is getting thick. I'm assuming someone's towing a van through here. I haven't passed the car for about 25 minutes and it's thick dust, so someone's got to be up here in front of me. Just stopped on because I've got on some tar. Look, tar for a while. Bike's handling it okay. <laughs> Bit rough, <laughs> but it's all right. Once I know I'm fully on the dirt and there's no more tar, I'll let the tires down. I think maybe to 30, and then start working it from there. I've put a nice desert fleck in the paint now. It's got this beautiful orange shade reflection when you see it in the sun. I think that's going to become a new thing.
Yeah, so I've stopped, so I've stopped for a drink of water. And it's just, back there, there's people around. I'm, it might be a bit early for them in the morning. But it's just sort of starting to dawn on me how remote, I suppose, this place is starting to become. It's all changing. There's just no one. Just me and me bike. It's pretty cool. Hanging out with me mate. This is becoming pretty hard work. It's becoming really hard work. And I don't, I don't know how far, 50 Ks maybe to go. I think when I said before I had like 60 or 70, I actually had 90. So I thought I'll hang out with these guys for a while. While all these guys just go around me. Hey guys, say hello. <laughs> Me horn's fucked. <laughs> Don't work no more. Made it to um Cohen. Not much going on here. I think I'm gonna push on and go up to Art Archer River, I think it is, for the night. Camp up there, it's only like sixty something Ks. It was I'll tell you what, I was struggling earlier today. I can't believe what the road's like. Well, I can. I can. But I think I should have been a little bit fitter. So I've just been hanging out here. I think I might hang out here for another half an hour under this tree. Cool down a little bit. Then head on up there. Running out of steam, guys. Cost ten bucks for the night for for me here. 
I've got a pretty good spot because I managed to just go next to a table. I don't know if it's going to make it to the top or not. I think maybe I shouldn't ride it as hard as I've been riding it in some spots into that creek and they've probably <laughs> nearly come a guts or twice into those creeks up there with the rocks. She's going pretty good considering it's a Harley Ultra Classic, <laughs> 12 years old. So I might throw me 10 up. Earlier in the day today, I was really suffering from a headache. I had a bit of fatigue, exhaustion and things. When I got to Cowan, I decided that I was, oh, I went to the shop to get some shit to eat and um, didn't like what was in the Bay of Marie. I wasn't gonna wait, so I bought a banana and I started to come good after that and got one of them Gatorade things into me. I felt a lot better. So I think I might have to eat some more bananas. But I was really struggling there at one stage today. It was really hard work, which, it, and I'm getting sick of people telling me I'm not going to make it, or telling me this, or telling me that, or telling me, oh, it's got a river, you know, or it's got a this, or it's got that. No shit, mate, it's a cape. I know they might be thinking they're trying to help, but just piss me off.